Hello and welcome to another episode of the DMG Tech Show. I am your host, Jonathan Parkinson. In this episode, I'm going to be showing you how to install Popcorn Time. Now, what Popcorn Time is, is what you can see right in front of you is, is watch your torrent movies instantly. No downloading. Well, there's a little bit of downloading, but it's not like you got to go to some of these torrent sites and get this. Now, I will be doing this for demonstration purposes, but just be careful for all you guys out there that are looking to do this as it is quote unquote illegal but uh, you know for educational purposes I would like to show you how to do this now as I scroll down as you see that is going to be the web address right there but I'm going to show you how to do it actually via the terminal uh, the reason why it's probably smarter to do it from the terminal is because I have seen people kind of run into some issues where all these downloads don't really work but it's good to know that it is available for Android uh, Mac computers Windows 32-bit uh, Linux as well as 64-bit Linux. Now I am running the Acer C720 and this is a 64-bit Linux distribution that I do have running. Uh, you can usually go into your application or sorry in your app menu go down to uh, system settings or wherever it's going to be go to about and you should be able to find it in there as you can see oh I don't have mine written there. Huh. Anyways, I do have, mine is a 64-bit, I do know that. Oh, there it is, sorry. It says on the very top. 64-bit. So make sure you do know what you're getting if you're going to come and download it this way. If you're going to do it from the PPA, don't worry about it. It'll take care of it for you. So to get it installed from the PPA, go ahead and type in these three commands. You're going to press Enter after each one of them. So the first command is going to be this. Go ahead and press Enter. That's just going to be adding the source. So you're adding this PPA source, which is saying, telling your computer to, hey, uh, for to download the program, you're going to need to go to this website to get it downloaded. The next command is going to be this, which is now telling our computer to update our uh, source list, letting it know that, hey, we have a new uh, link to go download something from. And then finally is going to be this command, and this is going to be the command to download it. Now, it's all depending on your internet connection. It could take anywhere from about a minute to five to ten minutes uh, for it to get downloaded. And that's all you need to do. Now, once you go up into your applications menu, now it could be a little different for you as it is for me. Uh, I just want to show you exactly, you know, I have it downloaded, but again, I'm just doing this for educational purposes completely. Uh, you're going to go up to Internet and you're going to see there's popcorn time there. And you just go ahead and click it, open it up, which I think I might have it opened up, which I don't. Uh, I will show you. It opens up like this. And there you go. So here is all the movies as you see as I scroll down, more will keep loading up here. Again, it all depends on what your internet connection is. Go up to the genres, you can flip through that way. Popularity, you can go that way as well. And then you can go into your TV series. Um, you're gonna come over to your settings. I actually haven't gone to settings, so I'll come in here right now. And you can see here's quality, everything. You know, you can kind of change a little bit maybe uh, if you're getting some lag. Uh, but again, I don't want to uh, say anything for sure because like I said earlier I am doing this completely for educational purposes. Uh, if you do have any questions or comments or anything about this uh, there is the comment section below you can leave it there I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.